And we are we are back. Psalms chapter 49. Listen, everyone, listen. Earth dwellers, don't miss this. All you haves and have nots, all together now listen. I set plain spoken wisdom before you, my heart seasoned understandings of life. I fine tuned my ear to the sayings of the wise. I solve life's riddles with the help of a harp. So why should I fear in bad times, hemmed in by enemy malice, shoved around by bullies, demeaned by the arrogant rich? Really, there's no such thing as self-rescue. Pulling yourself up by your bootstraps, the cost of rescue is beyond our means. And even then, it doesn't guarantee life forever or insurance against the black hole. Anyone can see that the brightest and best die, wiped out right along with fools and idiots. They leave all their prowess behind, move into their new home, the coffin, the cemetery, their permanent address, and to think they named counties after themselves. We aren't immortal, we don't last long. Like our dogs, we age and weaken and die. This is what happens to those who live for the moment who only look out for themselves. Death herds them like sheep straight to hell. They disappear down the gullet of the grave. They waste away to nothing. Nothing left but a marker in a cemetery. But me, God snatches me from the clutch of death. He reaches down and grabs me. So don't be impressed with those who get rich and pile up fame and fortune. They can't take it with them. Fame and fortune all get left behind. Just when they think they've arrived and folks praise them because they've made good, they enter the family burial plot where they'll never see sunshine again. We aren't immortal. We don't last long. Like our dogs, we age and weaken and die. Psalms chapter 50. The God of gods, it's God, speak, speaks out, shouts earth, welcomes the sun in the east, farewells the disappearing sun in the west. From the, dazzle, from the dazzle of Zion, God blazes into view. Our God makes his entrance. He's not shy in his coming. Starbursts of fireworks precede him. He summons heaven and earth as a jury. He's taking his people to court. Round up my saints who swore on the Bible their loyalty to me. The whole cosmos attests to the fairness of this court. That here God is judge. After you listening, after you listening, dear people, I'm getting ready to speak. Israel, I'm about, I'm about ready to bring you to trial. This is God, your God, speaking to you. I don't find fault with your acts of worship, the frequent burnt sacrifices you offer. But why should I want your blue ribbon bull or more and more goats from your herds? Every creature in the forest is mine. The wild animals on all the mountains. I know every mountain bird by name. The scampering field mice are my friends. If I get hungry, do you think I'd tell you? All creation and its bounty are mine. Do you think I feast on venison or drink drafts of goat's blood? Spread for me a banquet of praise. Serve high God a feast of kept promises. And call for help when you're in trouble. I'll help you and you'll honor me. Next, God calls up the wicked. What are you up to? Quoting my laws. Talking like we are good friends. You never answer the door when I call. You treat my words like garbage. If you find a thief, you make him your buddy. Adulterers are your friends of choice. Your mouth drools filth. Lying is a serious art form with you. You stab your own brother in the back, rip off your little sister. I kept a quiet patience while you did these things. You thought I went along with your game. I'm calling you on the carpet now, laying your wickedness out in plain sight. Time's up for playing fast and loose with me. I'm ready to pass sentence and there's no help in sight. It's the praising life that honors me. As soon as you set your foot on the way, I'll show you my salvation. Psalms chapter 51. 
Generous in love, God, give grace. Huge in mercy, wipe out my bad record, scrub away my guilt. Soak out my sins in your laundry, I know how bad I've been. My sins are staring me down. You're the one I violated, and you've seen it all, seen the full extent of my evil. I'm not joking. Whatever you decide about me is fair. I've been out of step with you for a long time, in the wrong since before I was born. What you're after is truth from the inside out. Enter me, then conceive a new, true life. Soak me in your laundry and I'll come out clean. Scrub me, scrub me and I'll have a snow white life. Tune me in to foot tapping songs. Set these once broken bones to dancing. Don't look too close for blemishes. Give me a clean bill of health. God, make a fresh start in me. Shape a genesis weak from the chaos of my life. Don't throw me out with the trash or fail to breathe holiness in me. Bring me back from gray exile. Put a fresh wind in my sails. Give me a job teaching rebels your way so the lost can find their way home. Commute my death sentence, God, my salvation, God, and I'll sing anthems to your life-giving ways. Unbutton my lips, dear God, I'll let loose with your praise. Going through the motions doesn't please you. A flawless performance is nothing to you. I learned God worship when my pride was shattered. Heart shattered lives ready, sorry, heart shattered lives ready for love. Don't for a moment escape God's notice. Make Zion the place you delight in. Repair Jerusalem's broken down walls. Then you'll get real worship from us. Acts of worship, small and large, including all the bulls they can have on onto, they can heave onto your altar. Amen. Amen.